Hi everyone, welcome back to the Dashboard Roadmap, a series where we explore some of the City Health Dashboard's best features. I'm Sammy, and in this episode, I'm going to walk you through the demographic detail page. The dashboard provides data disaggregated by race, ethnicity, sex, or age for a number of our metrics, including breast cancer deaths, high school completion, park access, and uninsurance. This feature allows users to investigate any gaps that exist between different demographic groups and can help you take a racial equity lens to improving community health. Today, we're heading to Nashua, New Hampshire, and we'll explore park access by demographic. You can access the demographic detail page here on the navigation bar. We provide park access data for the five major racial ethnic categories, and each of their scale bars is listed on top of each other for easy comparisons across demographic groups. There are a lot of numbers on this page, so we provide useful explainer text to help you understand what you're seeing. For context, in Nashua, 8% of the city's total population is Asian. The gold bar shows the city value for the racial ethnic group you're looking at, and the navy triangle below the scale indicates the dashboard city average for that same demographic group. In this case, 41% of the Asian residents in Nashua live within a 10-minute walk to a park, compared to 58.6% for all Asian residents across the dashboard cities. This means that Nashua's Asian residents have less park access on average than Asians in other cities. And if you look at the bar below, you can see that Nashua's black population is smaller than the Asian population, but those residents have higher park access than their Asian counterparts. And that's it for this episode of the Dashboard Roadmap on how to understand the demographic detail page. Thanks for tuning in. Don't hesitate to reach out with questions, comments, and ideas for future episodes by emailing info at cityhealthdashboard.com. See you on the site.